guns. They can be the subject of heated debate, but guns themselves aren't necessarily at issue in this proposed legislation. It's gun safety education. Whether you like guns or don't like, don't like guns, um, your kids can be exposed somewhere. That's why Derek so LeBlanc came up with the idea to down. allow schools in Oregon to teach first graders about gun safety. Statistics drives everything that we do. And so from about four to eight, that's where our kids are most vulnerable. The proposed bill says the 30 minute class would have to be taught by a teacher, administrator, law enforcement officer or first responder. It wouldn't involve any real guns and would teach kids how to respond if they encounter one. LeBlanc, through his nonprofit Kids Safe Foundation, has already reached 15,000 kids in Oregon, Washington and Northern California. We taught them those life saving skills, which is stop, don't touch, run away tell a grown-up. Some parents say they're all for the idea. And I feel comfortable with uh, kids learning about gun safety in school um, in order to be safe in case they do encounter a situation. Others are worried about opinions making their way into the classroom. It's too hard for a teacher to not put their opinions in. But LeBlanc says for him, it's not about pushing guns, it's about pushing safety. I had this idea on a Sunday um, in a coffee shop um, in December, and that night there was a kid that died 20 minutes from my house. And so this is something that, you know, is my fuel, you know, to, to keep going and to make sure that I can reach those ones that do need, need our help. So if past schools would also talk about the difference between video game violence and real life violence, and if parents don't want their kids to participate, they can opt out. Again, that public hearing at one o'clock in Salem. But again, this legislation still in the beginning stages and it still has a long way to go.